Mapping of the body is extremely important to anyone in the health sciences or medical fields. Whether you're a nurse aide or a doctor, you need to understand the body in order to care for a patient properly. Even surgeons typically will use a mapping of the body to confirm and make sure they are operating on the right part or section of the body. In the case of plastic surgery, the body sections will often be mapped out on the patient's body itself. Body planes are imaginary lines drawn through the body at various points to separate the body into sections. Directional terms are created by these planes. Like anything else, if you want to know where you're going, whether you are constructing a building or a road or putting together a toy or an appliance, you need a map or a set of blueprints or instructions to get the job done right. Views planes, and directional terms will be the first of two videos in this Mapping the Body series. In the next video, we will cover the body cavities, quadrants, and regions. The body has three basic views. Number one, the standard view, or the one most commonly known, is the ventral, or anterior view. Da Vinci's drawing of the Vitruvian Man is iconically used to demonstrate this view. This view includes the palms of the hands turned or showing to the front, which makes them ventral or interior. Number two is the dorsal or posterior view, which is the back of the body. And third, the lateral view. This is the side view of the body. So that covers the three different views. Now let's take a look at the three main planes of the body. Number one, the mid-sagittal or median plane. The mid-sagittal divides the body vertically down the center into right and left sides. Sagittal planes continue to divide the body vertically across the body. Now our first two directional terms come from the mid-sagittal plane. Body parts close to the median plane are called medial or the middle. As an example, the heart is medial. Now body parts away from the midline or median are called lateral. An example of lateral would be the lungs because they are towards the side of the body. The second plane is a frontal or coronal. This divides the body into a front section and a back section. Directional terms from this plane are ventral and dorsal. Body parts in the front of the plane are called ventral or anterior and body parts in the back of the plane are the dorsal or posterior. Our third one is the transverse plane. The transverse plane is commonly demonstrated by dividing the body into a top half and a bottom half, usually drawn through the navel. Transverse planes continue up and down the body horizontally. The directional terms for this one are superior and inferior. Superior is designated to body parts which are above another part. For example, the heart is superior to the stomach. Inferior references body parts below other parts. For example, the intestines are inferior to the stomach. Cranial means body parts located near the head. And caudal designates body parts located near the sacral region of the spinal column, also known as the tail. Other directional terms are proximal and distal. These are used to describe the location of the extremities, which are the arms and legs, in relation to specific points of reference on the trunk of the body. These points of reference are located at the shoulders and the hips. Body parts are either distal or proximal according to how far or close the part is to the point of reference. 
fingers and toes are the most distal, whereas the top of the humerus and the top of the femur bones are closest to the point of reference and are the most proximal. Here's a couple more examples. The elbow is proximal to the shoulder, whereas the wrist is distal to the shoulder. Or the ankle is proximal to the hip, whereas the toes are distal to the hip. Superficial. Superficial is near the outer surface of the organism. The skin is superficial to the muscle layer and or other body organs. The opposite of superficial is deep or visceral. Deep means further away from the surface of the organism. Visceral is of Latin origin, which is the internal organs or flesh associated with organs within the body's cavities. All right now, let's do a quick review. The three views of the body are the ventral, anterior, dorsal, posterior, and the lateral. Body planes are mid-sagittal or sagittal, transverse, and the coronal or frontal. Body directions medial versus lateral, superior versus inferior, and cranial versus caudal, proximal versus distal, and superficial versus deep. In our next video, we will finish up the mapping of the body series by discussing the body cavities, quadrants, and regions. Thanks for watching and look for more videos at ctskills.com.